Hello everyone, this is the Marvelous here, and today I'd like to tell you something about a replay between um, either a steel skin from Eyes of Mars Clan and RTK Captain Psycho from the Round Table Knights. Well, um, this was the final of the first Eliminated Tournament, hosted by the Eliminated Ones, and this was a classic tournament, so you could only bring the standard fac uh, factions. And uh, this was the fifth game of the final, which was a best of five, so it was uh, at a 2 2 score. And let's go over uh, EDA Steelskin's build. Um, here's first we have this Hattori Naginata Neg Samurai, um, two Bow Cavalry, both level 0, uh, General level 2, two Great Guards, and he has three Yari Cavalry. And on his right flank, he has a uh, Naginata Samurai. And um, this is a special feature of the Hattori clan because Hattori can they can um, deploy outside the deployment zone. So he has his infantry deployed outside the uh, deployment zone. Uh, one Mesok Ashigaru with uh, Yari Ashigaru behind it. He has two Naginata Samurai with two Katana Samurai, um, a Bow Ashigaru, and again a Mesok Ashigaru with a Yari Ashigaru. And from Cav the Psycho, he has uh, a Great Guard with a Fire Cav, 1, 2, 3, 4 uh, Naganata Warrior Monks, and 2 Nodeshi Samurai, both level 2. Um, he has a General, uh, 2 Bow Cavalry, 2 Naganata Samurai, and a Fire Cav, and another Great Guard. For the Dojos, we have a Sword Dojo on the left side, and a Farmhouse on the right side. When looking from Ida Stiltskin's perspective. Now, um, Captain Psycho, he has already seen that charging this uphill wouldn't do him any good since Ida Stiltskin has the uh, hill advantage. So he's moving it back to the left, and the first uh, engagements are already going on between his bow ash and his bow cavalry. And here, the fire cavalry is getting shot by the bow cav, only 3 kills so far. Let's take a look if you can get another shot. Yes, you can. Yes, 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 yes. He got uh, 7 kills in total from that fire cavalry. Still, can move his forest a little bit to the right. And still, some minor skirmishes going on. Oh, and Kevin Psycho has revealed a matchlock samurai his left flank, level 2. Now uh, both uh, Stiltskin and Kev have one matchlock here. Mesok Ashiko gets the matchlock Samurai. Stiltskin moving a bit to the left here to scare this Kev away, away from the farmhouse. And here's still some minor skirmishes going on. In the meantime, Kev is moving his forces all over the left side towards the left. Yeah, let's see if we can charge. No. Kev's pulling out. Some scrimmages here between the bow calf. Seven kills on the bow calf for calf against eleven kills for steel skin. Meantime, calf still moving. Changing this battlefield skill further and further to the left in order to avoid this big hill. Because when he can uh, move in from this side, the uh, steel skin won't have as much of a benefit from the hill. <laughs> and let's see, let's see what's happening. There's still some skirmishes. Ooh, we got some fair kills to Bow Ash. Yeah, thir plus 30 men. <coughs> Stiltskin deploying near the farmhouse. He now controls. No, he doesn't control the sword dojo yet. Oh, let's take a look. If we can get this, this great guard charging. Charging in. Yes, he's gonna get the charge. Yeah, there he goes. Oh, so about the charge. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the charge. Men flying everywhere. He got. Oh, 60 kills for the charge, a wonderful charge. <coughs> Is he going in for another one? Is he going in? Uh, 
No. Uh, he's pulling out. He doesn't get it. There are 60 kills on the match locks. And together with the spear, so the match lock lost um, 45 men. Oh, and here now, charging. This is only match locks. No, oh, you can just prevent it. Only a few guys are taking three, three losses. <coughs> Meantime, Kev still moving more to the left, and this fight Kev not getting, char getting uh, charged by the Yeri Kev, but he's pulling it back. And chased. He's trying to get a melee out here, but once the Naginata moves in, both uh, parties move out. Also on the right side, still some scrimmages for both Bo Kev. Bo Kev here already, 29 kills here. Well, Kev's bow calf is already on 50 kills. You can already see, you can see this battlefield changing from, from one line, which we used to be, is now already getting changing more and more to the left. Now, Kev the Psycho is moving his matchlock samurai here, which, if he does, is quite a smart move because he can get free shots at an Agonet samurai and as it's his left flank. Whilst um, either Stilskin doesn't have a match lock in the mid only in the middle, so you can prevent that. So Stilskin should have to retreat here or attack either way. Looks like he's retreating for now. Oh, and this great guy is charging the general, but he doesn't get it. Get blocked by a wire monk. Meantime, he still some shots at the great guard. Oh, they have high armor, so he won't, he won't get much kills. To Kev trying to hide here in the forest, and this pause here. You can see this very important sword Jojo here in Stiltskin's hands, but Kev of Saka is doing nothing in order to recapture it or at least try to prevent um, Stiltskin from having it, which is quite a mistake in my opinion because that sword is a really important Jojo, especially when the melee will start. Let's take a look here. Cavalry been moving in here a bit. No, he's getting charged at the six samurai. Yes, he will. Also on the Naginata samurai. Oh, 50 kills. Look, look, look more impressive than it was. Matchlock still lost quite some men here. Yeah. Cavalry. Now he is swifted the bow cavalry to the other side of the battlefield. So uh, he's also an advantage because Stillskin has this middle uh, of the battlefield. He can easily move forces from his, uh, one flank to the other flank. While Kev has to move run all the way around in order to um, move his troops around. Matchlock is getting some shots here to move warrior marks with very low armor. Uh, easy target. And now here you can see this Naginata Samurai is all surrounded here by, Kef, uh, by Kef's forces. And the Naginata no Dutch Samurai is going to try to take that one down. Most likely, yes. Um, meanwhile, it's uh, Kef's force from Steelskin is coming in now. I'm trying to, uh, to save this, uh, save this Naginata Samurai. He's getting charged by the Fire Kef and by the no Dutch Samurai. Oh, and he's getting this great card. Can he get it through? Can he get it through? No, 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 no. He does get it through. Ooh, it's lucky for Kev to buy him some time in order to relocate his great card. And here, the Yuri Cavalry is chasing the Fire Cavalry together with this Naginata, which is being chased by another Dutch Samurai again. Here, the monks are moving in on the Mr. Kashikaru and on the Kev. Will he attack or will he pull it back? Uh, he's pulling it back, he's pulling it back. Fire cavalry can be charged by the great guard. And still here, fire cavalry charged by the Yari Cav with the Naginat Samurai. And there's no Jetchi still in chase. Ooh, and here he comes, here he comes. Yari Cav is going to charge the Magic Samurai. He gets some shots off, he gets some shots off. No, 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 no. Oh, what's this great guard doing? Should charge him? Yeah, yeah, it's a great guard charging the Yari Cav. Meantime, thank you very much for moving to the left to support this. Um, 
The great god can charge by the bring it away much now uh, loses loses some men into this man. Like your mistake from steel skin. Whilst the Negan Samurai are fighting together with 19 very calf this new Dutch Samurai. And this Takeda Fire Cap is coming back from routing. So as you can see now the main attack from Captain Psycho is commencing. He's moving his Nagan at the warrior monk. The warrior monks is moving them in towards this middle in order to try to take it out. In the meantime also this Nagan at Samurai is uh, coming in. So let's see he has an all out from all sides. He's attacking now the steel skin with uh, spear heavy infantry units. And ooh, still uh, Captain Psycho won this battle with the uh, Nordic Samurai against the uh, was it Nagunet Samurai and Jerry Calf. The great guy is gonna charge on the enemy gen. We uh, not losing much yet. Well the Bow Calf are still running around and ooh we have four four uh, melee units taking the Sherry Ash which will soon route. He can be holding on now. Oh, look at this sandwich. This sandwich from Negative Samurai. But the Negative Samurai itself are also getting sandwiched by Scaf and the Negative Samurai. Bokaf moving in, trying to get some charges. Oh, micro mistake, pulling them out. Yes, yes, yes. Infantry is now moving on. So trying to take that hill, that hill and move towards this Magic Ashigaru because that should be that's where he wants to go. Hodachi also coming back, great guard. So still skin is really surrounded by so he's still an opening left on this on his left side, an opening. Let's see, there's two matchlocks. So let's see if we can uh, move the second match from into position. We can get some nice shots of it as well, my Mario Monks. Oh, and there they come, the Mario Monks. Three by Monks moving in towards the neck of the Samurai. <coughs> well, on the shot from, from the Magic Samurai and the Bokaf. So they will be taking some losses, but the sooner the better. About this Negonet Samurai. Whilst he has to pull out one barrier monk because the Katana Samurai and the uh, Yari Ashikaru are taking them from the back. And let's take another pause. The ne Negonet Samurai is fighting an, uh, another ne Negonet Samurai and a great guard for Steels. So, what is he left? Steels has a great guard, Negonet Samurai, Head with Katana Samurai. Two bow calf, a matchlock, a bow ashigaru, and uh, the general is katana sam and a neganeta samurai left. Oh, and a routing neganeta samurai, which hasn't routed yet, but will soon route. For calf, he has two, ex uh, excuse me, a bow calf, a great guard, no dachi sam, matchlock samurai. Nekin at the White Monk is fighting this Katana Sam. Those two very important warrior uh, monks, they're very important. Once they get rid of this unit, they should move towards this um, important matchlock. Because once they get take that one out, it will be a huge benefit. And Nekin at Sam and his general. So let's see how things evolve. It shouldn't be long since the Nekin at will be routing. Yes, there it goes. Now he's going to move all in on the charge, charge these. Meantime, this Mestic Ashikari still hasn't routed. So he is, let it go, big charge. Yeah, losing. The Naganet Samurai of Stiltskin is killed. Cash one. So, uh, close battle, but still only 46 left. And two Bokaf. Stiltskin. General only. Ooh, only 7 men left for his general. Units only go after the general and after the bow cavalry. Four men left, will not be able to make it up here. There comes the great guard. In the meantime, Seal Skins 
Biomarks are really doing an impressive job. 100 plus kills for both Biomarks. Oh, and there goes the general. Still skins out of the general. But this great guy is charging a general and a Bokath. So, Kev's uh, general is also in danger. Now, let's see. Ooh, we got Katana Samurai is moving in to, kill, uh, to take out this warrior monks. But on the other side, the great guard is charging the bow cavalry. Well, the match looks Samurai is still left for, uh, for Kev. Ooh, and there goes the bow Kev. Only the general left, charged by the great guard. Great guy is going to get the charge at the Mesh as we are out and then back charge. Emra and Anvil charge at the Katana Sam. Already routed one and one is. Uh, yes, to route both Katanas. Bow Cavalry going for the Mesh Lux Samurai. Okay, back at shot, but he will take the bane. General still being chased by the Great Guard. What are we going to do? Uh, oh, it's going for the. Ooh, this is an interesting move. Let's see. Ooh, Kev's dismounting his general. Dismounting his general. It's a very wise move against those, uh, those great guards. Let's pause again. So, what do we have left? Two Naganeta warrior monks. Uh, 50 men. 50 men of Naganeta warrior monks for Kev. Dismounted general. 30 men left. While under attack from a great guard. And a 19 unit great guard for Kev. And on the other side, we have two Bo Kev of. 17 men of Bokev left, one uh, Master Kashigari is still firing, and a Great Guard. Will be an extremely close battle. Let's see, we can get this uh, Mug to route. Still hasn't routed yet. General still alive. Unit loose decisively, seven men still. Matchlock still firing. Ooh, and a Great Guard is charging this Bokev. And oh, Sooner attack general, still alive. Get him to warrior marks. His match of Kashikaru are also routed. So, general, great guard, warrior mark for Kev. And oh, the bow Kev is going for the general. Let's go for the general. Better take it. Making another warrior marks coming in. Better going for the general. Oh, yes, he got it. He got it. Definitely, yes. Okay, uh, Cash General has also fallen. So, two Bokeh, Thursus, a Great Guard, and then again a Warrior Mark of 26 men. And a General for one member, so we'll route soon. Bokeh going into the Great Guard, and the Great Guard was routed. Other Bokeh not charging, the Great Guard. Still 35 men left. Great Guard is routing, ooh, 35 Bokeh leave, Thursus, 26 Warrior Marks. Woke up really for his warrior marks, 26. Oh, he's, he's tired. It's uh, very tired, so he's routing. Is he going to route or not? Oh, it's routing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, Kev. So, well, that was it. EDA Steelskin wins the first Eliminate Championship in the fifth battle of the best of five. With only one Woke advantage over and routed. Um, for a routed warrior mark. So let's take a look at the stats and come up soon. I can already inform you that in the third place, RTK Vim has beaten 3 to 1 uh, USSR Ad Adela. So RTK Vim got a third place. Second place also goes to RTK Clan with Kaf. And first place going to EDA Steelscan. And let's take a look at the statistics. Steelscan deployed way more men. So we could also lose more. It's the advantage of the numbers. And 100 kills for this uh, Katana Sam for the Naked Sam. Ooh, and the Bokev did a good job. Look at that. 200 kills for the Bokev. And for Captain Psycho. Wow, look at this warrior monks. 400 kills for these two units. They really wrecked them up. And also three, almost 300 kills for these two great guards. Well, it was a thrilling battle, thank you all for watching and uh, see you later.